everybody. This is Dennis again with you. I'm going to uh, show you a little fast lick you can learn uh, on acoustic guitar. It works on electric as well, but why should they have all the fun? So this is going to be an E, and it's going to do a little three-note pattern, but we're going to actually hit a, a fourth stroke. It's, it's what I usually do to, instead of going, I do two on the last one, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, because I can seem to control that better with getting my little finger back up. So we're going to go to the seventh, fifth, and fourth fret and go twice, okay? You can actually get pretty quick once your fingers loosen up. So I'm going to do that. The same exact pattern on the second string. So you got and then come back to the first string to drop down a note to where you're on the uh, fifth, fourth, and second. I, I use my ring finger because it's stronger than my little finger there, so use whichever one you want. Same thing, one, two, one, two, and then on the second string, same thing. That's a good thing about the first two strings. You can do the same positions usually, and it sounds good. So, so far we got... Okay, so we're back to the first string, and we're going to go third, second open okay got that cool. first second string same thing so far we got and then once we're here go second one open on second Hit twice again. Now that gets you can it takes a little bit of you can play as slow as you want or as fast as your fingers can do. So even slow here is gonna be the whole thing. the whole thing. I'll try to play it fairly quick. I'm a little stiff this morning, but we'll try it. Let's kind of get that one going. And uh, hopefully you can get really good at something like that. But I like to use that second down, up, down, up. Because that gives me time to get that little finger, which is slower these days at my age. Was always fun, even by itself, if you were me. Hit your big old leg again. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you if you like that, or leave me a message if there's something you'd like to see or have some questions. I'll see you next time.